We are in week 9 Friday. We are doing Chinese this week. And today what we have is a cumin chicken. So with that we are going to serve a cumin fried rice. So let's talk about the fried rice first. So it's a vegetarian fried rice. So we have some vegetables here. White of the green onions or scallions. Bell peppers, that's green and some red. Red peppers and then cumin, uh, celery. And what I did here is I put these greens, julienne these greens from the scallions or green onions and put it in cold water. And you can see this curls up slight bit. So when we do the garnish, it will look really beautiful. The cumin chicken is, is, very, is a simple, simple, simple dish. There are only few ingredients and very easy to cook. So the ingredients for the cumin chicken are obviously chicken and then a lot of cilantro or coriander leaves. One of the things with the coriander leaves is or, or any leaves it, it, it has a lot of dirt and dust. So we had to rinse these for about four or five times before we got rid of all the dirt. So please be careful when you buy and when you store uh, the green. Then for the cumin chicken, we have two types of cumin. We have whole cumin. That's about a two, two teaspoons of uh, cumin and then we have some ground cumin. We have a little bit of soy sauce and these are about 40 red peppers that I put into hot water and let it seep. So we'll use the water as well as the, as well as the chilies. So let us start off with the rice, saute these uh, vegetables with some um, uh, cumin and then we'll put the rice in, we'll fry it. For the chicken, we'll fry the chicken and then we'll mix it with all of these ingredients and then uh, at, at the end we'll put uh, the, the coriander leaves. So let's start cooking. The pan is hot. We put some olive oil. We start off with the cumin seeds and the chili paper. So this will flavor the oil. and you put all the other vegetables in. This is a quick saute. I don't want to cook the vegetables too much. I still want a little bit of bite. Little bit of salt and I want to put a little lots of pepper. It will give that spicy feeling. So fried rice is best made with um, a day old rice. I don't have a day old rice. I cook this in my rice cooker and then I broke it up you want to make sure that the rice is cold and it has stood for a little bit before you start the fry this will give you the best result A 
like to use two spoons or spatulas for this. Because we'll eat this rice with the chicken, I don't want to over season it. The rice is cooked. You can see the fried rice is all done. The taste is good. It, is, it doesn't have too much salt. Perfect for to eat with um, with some uh, you know with the cumin chicken that we'll do. So I'll shut this off and put it into a platter to, to serve it. The pan is hot. Put in a little bit of oil and then we pat it dry the chicken and we'll fry it on high heat. Till it's golden. We already fried a couple of batches. This is the last batch. We'll show you uh, once it's done. Uh, you know, it is like this, uh, golden color. So this is done. So take it out. And then from here on, it is very quick. So we are all ready with everything else. We'll add the cumin seeds, a little bit more olive oil, you don't need too much, the heat is off, you can see the residual, in the residual heat, it will still, we need a lot of cumin seeds and it will cook in the residual heat and so, and then we'll put the chilies in. These are, this have been soaked in wa warm water. So I did not remove the seeds. If you want to remove the seeds, it's totally up to you. We'll use the water as well. I turn the heat on again. So I add half of the cumin powder. Let the chicken back on. It's already smelling of <laughs> cumin. We add half a little more than half of the coriander. So this is this is two bunches of coriander. We put the soy sauce and the water from the chili. We add the coriander, the rest of the coriander. And then we throw 
close the lid for a few minutes for the chicken to cook through and then we'll stir it and then at the end we'll put the cumin so let's come back in five minutes and we'll show you the chicken is done at this point we'll add the rest of the cumin on the top so this will give that additional aroma of cumin you can see the the coriander leaves have whittled down and it's fried properly so this will give the coriander and, and cumin flavors that's the last of our Chinese dishes for this week we have a fried rice which is a vegetable fried rice and then cumin chicken Hope you like the video. Please do make it and let us know. Thank you. Have a nice day. Have a nice weekend and bon appetit.